Welcome to the world's most spacious physician office waiting room. Uh, this is Timmy Goes to the Doctor from Yes, This is Comedy 3. It is uh, a sketch I wrote that is based on a character less originated back at the, uh, at the station, the WBWC, back in 1980, much like Bruce Van Dyke's Charlie the Dancing Man, which he invented in the moment to crack us all up, less would riff on this little sort of six-year-old Hungarian kid, uh, a precocious kid, a.k.a. brat, uh, and he would do this character, this high-voiced little kid at to the station to crack us up, so I thought, that's a funny character, let's put him in some sketches, so I wrote a sketch for him in 1980 for the uh, Yes, This Is Comedy Halloween show, which came out pretty funny, and that sketch, uh, Timmy provokes and taunts um, poor adults, and uh, in this sketch, I thought, let's, let's take him to the doctor for the video show. Uh, this is one of only five sketches in the entire Yes, This Is Comedy run where the four of us, the main four cast members, Les, Bruce, Glenn, and I, appear in a scene together. Um, we're in a lot of sketches together, but only those five are we in the same shot, like you see here. And so I, I have a love-hate relationship with this sketch, much like I do a lot of... Uh, uh, the sketches in the first three shows. I love the performances. Les is very funny. I like how we all play off each other, including Mike Walschleger, who was a new cast member for Yes, This Is Comedy 3, who you're about to see in a moment as uh, the doctor. I love the business that uh, that Les does with all of us, especially this moment with Bruce, where he, he torments him with the face and Bruce scares him back into his seat. Uh, but I don't like at all the production values. I mean, this is supposed to be a doctor's office. It clearly isn't with the long cyclorama curtain and the, you know, the big space. We should have done this in a doctor's office, but it just wasn't possible. Um, I, the audio is not good. For whatever reason, we could not or weren't able to mic large groups of people well. It's a very cacophonous sound. Um, this is a live sketch with three cameras, you know, switched back and forth, camera one, two, and three, and many of the comedic beats that are important are missed by the direction, so that was a disappointment. There's Mike Walschleger making one of his first appearances on our show, bringing a nice vibe to the show as always. Um, I love what Glenn does with his straight man character when he's not attacking poor Timmy. Uh, I love Bruce's bit with his sickness and what he does too, but the technical stuff nearly sinks this sketch, and I say nearly because nothing can overcome Les's energy. Les is terrific, um, but the sketch and a lot of what we did in uh, episode three taught us that we should stay away from live three camera shoots because they just aren't all that credible setting-wise and technically, so we avoided that starting with episode four. Now, um, this, is, uh, this, is, this moment right here references a little brown bottle that uh, Timmy forgot to fill up at home. This was f based on back in the, in the day when I was a kid. This is when you had to bring your own urine sample from home in a bottle you brought as opposed to doing it at the doctor's office, which I always thought was weird. So I wanted to fit that in here too. But, um, you know, all in all, it's a funny sketch because of the energy we all bring, especially less. And uh, this is Timmy Goes to the Doctor, and we move on from episode three.